This is calculator question number 20 from SAT practice test 1 from the College Board of the Khan Academy website. And they give us a word problem involving purchasing a computer at a discount. And the question is, what was the original price if the discount price with sales tax was P? We can do this algebraically, but I'm going to do it by making up numbers first. Let's choose a price for the original price. I'm going to choose $100 because it's easy to take a 20% discount off $100. So our discount is 20, leaving discounted price $80. And then we pay 8% sales tax, which our cal calculator will tell us that the tax is $640, leaving a total price paid. P equals 86.40. Now I can use this in each choice. They're asking which of the following represents the original price. So if I put P equals 86.40 into each of these, the one that gives me $100 will be the correct answer. So if I try 86.40 times 0.88, that's choice A, and that's $76, which is not right. How about 8640 over 0.88, that's $98, that's much closer, but it's still not right. So A and B are wrong. What about 0.8 times 1.08 times 8640? And that's $74, which is not right. On the last one, I'm going to be careful. I can take 8640, divide by, and put my denominator in parentheses, 0.8 times 1.08 close those parentheses, and I get exactly 100, which is the correct original price. And they're saying which expression gives us the original price, so D would be correct. Or I could take A640, divide by 0.8, and then divide that answer by 1.08. They both tell me that choice D is correct. And that's my preferred way of solving this, since we're trying to find the correct answer, not show off showing our work. But let's do it algebraically just for the practice with algebra. We're told that the amount we paid, P, is our original price. With a 20% discount, so that's 1 times the original minus 0 0.2 times the original is a 20% discount. And then we're going to add our sales tax of 8%. So it's one times the amount we paid for the original price discounted plus 0 0.08 times that amount for our tax. So this one times our discount price plus is our price plus 0 0.08 times discount price is our tax. So that's P equals the original times 1 minus 0.2 is 0.8, and 1 plus 0.08 is 1.08. To solve for the original price, I'm going to divide both sides by 0.8 times 1.08. And that gives me P over 0 0.8, 1.08 equals the original. And that's the expression they're asking for. So it would be choice D. But I feel much more comfortable choosing a number for the original price and then doing the arithmetic on that rather than doing the algebra where I might get confused. College Board often asks you this sort of problem where they take a percent off and then add another percent on, or the reverse. So come back soon for my next math video. With math, there's always more.